In this video, we will learn how we can copy data from another file, Excel file, and then paste it into our template that we are building. So I have two files open. So on the left is what we are currently building. And so far we have only built with a so few rows of sample data. And now what we're going to do is to copy the data from an already existing file. So this is on the right a file where I've already completed building my dashboard and previously, and then I have some data on employees and vacation, which I can copy over to this. So this is something that um, you should always understand that when you copy and paste from another file, uh, there are some important things we need to know um, in, in the copy paste operation. For example, when we have the employee data here, so the generally the recommended approach is you select all of them and then copy or control C for copy. And then you come over here and then you, you obviously want to make sure that you are pasting similar uh, data structure. So here I have four columns, employee name, start date and date department. The source is also in the same structure. If your source has different columns ordering, then you cannot do all. You may have to select only the employee data and then paste it only this and separately. But now since it's the exact copy, I'm going to just select all the cells. I'm going to come here. Um, and then this is the recommended approach paste as values. Um, this would ensure that all the uh, formatting and if there are any formulas, they don't come over here. We don't want any of that. We just want the raw values in the data set. So now we have copied it over. It's very simple. Um, and then let's go to the vacation sheet on this side and then also vacation sheet on this side. And what we're going to do is copy this time. You can do control A. If you're inside a table, it'll automatically select all the data. And then you do control C for copy. And then you come over here, make sure that you right click in the first cell and then paste as values. This, you can see that even though the formatting looks different on both sides, the data itself is the same. Uh, we have up to row 61, so 60 rows of employee vacation data, same thing here. So this is how easy, but it's something that we need to be careful and not just copy paste uh, uh, directly. We should always use the paste as values option, which ensures that uh, only the data gets copied over. So now that we have um, copied the data over, I can maximize this screen. I'm going to save my file and let's take a look at our dashboard. Now you can see that the dashboard now is getting populated with more uh, colors and also the more employees are listed. And that's because we have, um, you know, more vacation data and employee data that is being used for the display. So so that completes our data copy paste step and now we can move on to the next step.